Yeah. Uh, Coach, win another series. Just your thoughts on this one. Yeah, I thought today was tough. I, I didn't think Root had his best stuff. I think he walked four or five guys. Uh, but the good ones just manage it. Um, offensively, it was, you know, tougher conditions to hit um, today. But our guys just scratch runs. Uh, JC with two two-out RBIs. Uh, Riley Johnson just getting on base and putting pressure on them. And um, us executing a safety sack. I thought we played great defense. Um, thought uh, Kobe Wallace made a lot of great plays. Oh, JC's throw from the corner to get the guy trying to stretch a single into a double. So we just played really good defense and we pitched great, uh, which is a recipe for success. So proud of our guys. Third largest crowd in CLC history. What does that mean for you guys to have that crowd behind you on a Saturday like this? Yeah, it was awesome. You know, uh, really wish we could have done some more things offensively to get them into the game a little bit more. But we're going to need them tomorrow um, to have the opportunity to go for a sweep. So we need uh, Pirate Nation to come out loud and proud tomorrow too. With the wind, obviously, how nice is it to have the pitching and defense on point like it was? We needed it. I mean, because if we hadn't had it, we probably would have got beat. So uh, it's just great to see our guys pound the strike zone and uh, let the defense. Shaq made a great play coming in on a uh, slow chopper as well. He's played great at short. You know, when they make that, that mental error in the third, thinking the outs, and then you guys capitalize on it, I mean, just how nice to kind of come through in that, that moment. Yeah, to... that's, what, uh, that's what championship teams do. So it's good to see and uh, good to see J.C. come through the clutch. Obviously, he goes four, he almost looks like he only throws two innings. He's so efficient, he just, you know, continues just to deliver. You know. Yeah, I mean, he's been great. He's got a great mentality. He's got a closer's mentality, and, and that's the thing about our bullpen. We've got multiple guys. Obviously, he's our go-to guy, but, um, you know, Danny had thrown this this weekend. We've got a lot of fresh guys, Jake Hunter, um, for tomorrow. So, we might see a lot of guys tomorrow. Any idea you'll start? Not yet. I go. Uh, yeah, yeah I know. And then yeah. Root, just, I mean, at the end of the outing, it looked like the control kind of just left him a little bit too. But, I mean, before that, obviously pretty good. Was he just kind of maybe running out of gas? Or? Uh, I don't know. I mean, to be honest with you, uh, I don't think he's been sharp for three weeks. So, I want him to get back like he was early in the season. I don't know if he's going through kind of like a mid-season lull of just fatigue and stuff. I mean, he's been taking the ball every weekend, which is the first time he's had to do that in college. So, uh, sometimes that can wear on him. Uh, but I have no idea. But we need to get him a little bit sharper to for this stretch run. Part of when he's going up the middle and opposite field, I mean, he just looks like such a complete hitter. Just, is that kind of a, the next step for him? Yeah, I mean, I, look, it, Bristol has actually worked really hard. I mean, if you just seen him in high school, he hit for more power, but I knew that that was going to be a lot of strikeouts in college, and he's done a great job of just simplifying his swing and being a line drive hitter. He, the power is going to continue to come, but he gets the drag bumps down, um, puts pressure on the defense, so that's all we can ask from him. Thank you, guys.